So what should be done to feel and look young? To stay young all your life? I see a tree it reaches a certain size. And that's it, it reaches saturation and it doesn't grow anymore. The sun has reached saturation, does not age, does not become weaker, with time, it has a winning activity. All nature strives for existence. Nature has to be inherent in something, it has to exist in something, the whole essence of nature is existence. And it is true that among the laws of nature there are laws that make it possible to lose nature, these are not considered part of nature, because nature cannot destroy itself, because if it destroys itself it will no longer be nature. But the laws of nature have an interest in continuing to exist in full force. Therefore we have room to understand that there is a way to be young, when you are young you are the best, you are alert, you are strong, you feel good. From when you started to develop until you reach saturation. So today, I want to give you three questions, that once you know the answers to these questions, you will know the secret, what needs to be done in order to stay young. After I ask these questions, I will expect you to write to me in the comment below, what are your answers to these questions, and after you have answers to the questions I will share my answer with you. Why? Because I want you to also know how to use your mind, and not to depend on others to eat the studied material for you. We need to have mental abilities, to be self-fed and to understand principles. So our three questions for today, 1. Does our body need to regenerate in order to live? This is the first question. Does the body need to regenerate in order to continue living? Or does it not need to be renewed? Think about stomach, nails, hair, obesity, or anorexia. 2. If it needs to be renewed, what are the raw materials that renew it? And 3. What is the natural way in the world to renew raw material without it being spoiled? Consider that a tree that is not fertilized, then it begins to bear fruit from worms until finally after a few decades it stops bearing fruit. Think, is there a tree or creature that brings animals back to life? Eggs? Milk? Taking the leftovers and putting them together to be the same creation over and over again. I'll give you an example. I breathe air, I exhale air, I drink water, emit water, I eat solids, emit the solids. There is a process of acceptance and return. And we need to find a process in which if I have eaten solids, that these solids will return to form again, and keep being of the same essence. That these liquids will come back together once again to be the same part of the same essence again. So think if there is a way that you eat something, and that something gets reconnected, reassembled and built to be the same thing only developed and newer. That I can be nourished by it again and again, something that has a history of development without essential change other than disassembly and assembly. I am waiting for your comments below the video and I will share with you the way to the answer that I discovered if necessary. Don't forget to give a like. In our temporary channel, we deal with all sorts of interesting areas. We will present here instructive natural phenomena and we will talk here about a worldview that gives meaning to life and hope for a better future. So if you are interested in this type of content, feel free to subscribe to the channel and click the bell to be notified of any new video that comes up. And see you next time. Translation, Google's Translation. Narration, Movio.la. Recording, Audacity. There is no copyright on this content and any beneficial use may be made of it or part of it. I was the voice of Emma.